The Indian independence movement, led by Mahatma Gandhi and various other leaders, was a significant chapter in India's history that aimed to end British colonial rule and secure India's independence. At the forefront of this movement was Mahatma Gandhi, who advocated for non-violence, civil disobedience, and peaceful resistance as powerful tools for achieving freedom and social change. Let's delve into the details of the Indian independence movement and Gandhi's philosophy of non-violence. Background and British Rule A. British Colonialism India was under British rule for nearly 200 years, starting from the establishment of the British East India Company's trading posts in the 17th century. B. Impact of British Rule British colonial policies, including economic exploitation, political control, and cultural subjugation, created discontent and fueled aspirations for self-governance. Mahatma Gandhi and Nonviolence A. Early Life and Influence Mahatma Gandhi, born in 1869, was inspired by religious teachings, philosophers like Henry David Thoreau, and his own experiences of racial discrimination in South Africa. B. Satyagraha Gandhi developed the concept of Satyagraha, which emphasized the power of truth, non-violence, and peaceful resistance to challenge unjust laws and oppressive regimes. C. Civil Disobedience Gandhi encouraged civil disobedience, including boycotts, non-cooperation, and acts of peaceful protest, as effective means to challenge British authority and expose the moral contradictions of colonial rule. Salt March and Civil Disobedience A. Salt March, Dandy March In 1930, Gandhi led the famous Salt March, a 240-mile protest against the British salt tax, symbolizing the defiance of unjust laws and inspiring thousands to join the movement. B. Civil Disobedience Movement The Salt March marked the beginning of the Civil Disobedience Movement, a mass campaign of non-violent resistance against British rule, with Indians boycotting British goods, refusing to pay taxes, and engaging in acts of peaceful protest. Quit India Movement and Independence A. Quit India Movement In 1942, Gandhi launched the Quit India Movement, calling for the immediate end of British rule in India. The movement witnessed widespread protests and acts of civil disobedience, leading to mass arrests and repression by the British authorities. B. Indian Independence The relentless efforts of leaders like Gandhi, along with the united struggle of Indians across different regions and communities, eventually led to India's independence on August 15, 1947. Legacy and Impact A. Nonviolent Resistance Gandhi's philosophy of nonviolence left a lasting impact on global movements for justice and freedom, inspiring civil rights leaders like Martin Luther King Jr. and Nelson Mandela. B. Unity and Secularism the Indian independence movement fostered a sense of unity among diverse communities and laid the foundation for a secular and democratic India. C. Socio-economic reforms. The movement also highlighted the need for social and economic reforms, including the eradication of untouchability, women's rights, and land reforms.